do you think it's smart to do a like first round you blanket the entire state and see where you get the best responses from? Well, and do then, and then drill them. And what? And what? Pick one. See, go after it hardcore. See what happens. And then if it's a dud, then you go on to the next one. Well, that's a good question. I would never limit you from doing, like say, don't do more. Here's what I'd like you to do those. I wanna want get 500 out of this list. Right, no, and, the, and the goal would be, we're gonna create a pattern. Like, this is the pattern. We're gonna voicemail blast them this week. We're gonna text message drop them next week. We're gonna email them the next week. We're gonna send them a piece of mail every month. And then when that 500 is being just consistently like a machine, hey, you know, oh, it's John calling me again. What's up, John? You know what I mean? That's where we want to be. Every time you see a vacant, boarded up, distressed, trashed, or even like, that's a cool building. I'd like to, what you know, like that. And I, I want, you'll create a separate list out of that going, hey, this is like my special list, right? And we'll probably put those on a more hyper aggressive track, right? So if we're picking 500, we're gonna like hit them. I mean, once a month is a lot, especially people that already told you they don't want to buy, they don't want to sell. So we're just gonna stay, stay the course and hit them every month. Once a month, boom, boom, boom. Consistent, always here, just doing a job. And then you're gonna have your special target list, right? Which would be something like where we walked through the properties yesterday and there's like that city block. If you pulled that project off, there's, million, there's millions of dollars in the deal we just talked about yesterday. You know what I mean? And everybody know who you are. You know what I mean? Like you're, oh, that. Yeah, even if you just sold the option to another developer or we ended up doing a joint venture. And I'll walk you through all the steps if you want to go after stuff like that. But the key is to target that. It's like we want, we go out and walk out, walk that thing yesterday. Like we can, I can give you the vision, I can paint the picture and we can talk about it walking around the neighborhood, right? If tomorrow you go find another one like that and we go do that same conversation. What if we, but the work comes in like, all right, so we broke down the addresses yesterday and we're gonna take those addresses and we're going to, we would look them up on CoStar for their name, the owner's names, right? You're gonna build that target market, a specialty target. And then we're, we would take that and send that off to the skip tracer so that they can get us the, um, the names and phone numbers. So ultimately I wanna take that 500 and put it into the CRM so that we can log, you know, Picture, picture of the property, the guy's name. His, his dog's name is Spot, and his wife's name is Sally. And I had dinner with him on the 17th, and a, a database of guys who own these properties. Every time you write a marketing piece, every time you make a voicemail, every time you plan a meetup, every time you do anything in your game, being the person who's making it available and creating the platform and creating the space to have those conversations, is gonna put you at, at a different level, you know what I mean?